guys. Thank you very much for watching Not Timmy 66 and thank you guys very much for the comments. Um, uh, you guys let me know if uh, the videos that I'm posting here during the training are just a little bit too boring for you um, or if you do like seeing them. Um, I do appreciate all the comments and concerns. I get dirt on my face still from work. But um, anyway, if you're interested, here is day two. So enjoy. Well, good morning, YouTube. How's everybody doing? It is now Tuesday, the 20th at uh, 642, man. Let's go to work. Day two, on the way. What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to Now Timmy 66 for day two of our FedEx ground experience. Hope everybody is doing well today. We're a little bit different shirt today, man. I know I'm going to be getting a uniform pretty soon, but I had to wear something that was a little bit more cool, I guess. This is like that wicking stuff or whatever. But anyway, yeah, so I'm getting ready to start day two now. Yesterday was really heavy. Um, I didn't get a whole lot of training in. Well, I did, and I did. Um, I got training in because... You know, I followed him around and kind of saw a little bit of the route, but everything was pretty fast and furious yesterday. It was, at, at a couple points, it was kind of questionable whether or not we were going to complete our pickups, which is not a good thing. I'll get into pickups um, a little bit later as I understand them more, but you have a certain time window that you have to go pick up certain things on this route, and you don't want to miss that pickup window. Um, it's not good. So ideally, you get all your deliveries done and then you do your pickups after that. That's the best ideal way to do it. But sometimes you end up having to do a pickup and then go do some more deliveries. It just kind of depends on what's going on. And yesterday was kind of one of those days. Now my trainer said he hates it being that way. Um, now on the flip side of that, if it's a really, really light day, um, you could be done by, I don't know, one o'clock, noon, something like that, with all your deliveries, and then you have to wait um, to go get your pickups because your pickups may not start till two, three, four o'clock in the afternoon. I think the latest pickup we have, um, or that I'm gonna have on my route, is gonna be four o'clock, four to six, and that's at a um, FedEx store inside of Walmart. So, yeah, there's that. But, yeah, man, let's get day two started. Got plenty of water. Got some snacks. Um, Going to go in here in just a few minutes and see what the rest of the day has to offer. I'll try to go ahead and get some filming done today if possible. Uh, if not, I'll definitely check back with you all, um, let you know how the day went. Hope everybody's having a great day. Thanks very much for subscribing to the channel, by the way. If you haven't subscribed, please do so. A um, lot more to come, guys. Hang in there. I'll be back. All right, guys. Welcome inside the truck. Definitely a little bit lighter today. Just going through and changing these stickers over. So, for like today, 105 stops. View of the truck. Guys, this is more shots of the terminal. What it looks like there is our iPad with our ground cloud app on it. We got a backup camera, and of course, we got the trusty scanner. I'm trying to show you guys a little bit more of the truck. We're about ready to roll out, it's uh, about 8 30. Alright guys, Not Timmy 66 back again. 
have completed day two and I'm almost home. So some reflections on day two of FedEx ground. I'm pretty tired today, man. Um, I ain't gonna lie. Um, today wore me out. And I don't know if it was more heat related or just customer related. We should have been done an hour before we got done because it took a customer 25 minutes to get a box ready to go for a pickup. And, you know, that's just part of the game. That's part of what happens sometimes. But um, we ended up finishing strong, getting back to the uh, center at about uh, the terminal, about five minutes to six. Started my day at about 7.30. So, good day all in all. I am learning more today. Uh, trainer had me running the scanner. Scanner is pretty much easy, I would say. I wouldn't say there's anything really difficult about FedEx ground scanner. Um, I'm starting to kind of recognize places on the route that we're going, which is always a good thing. Um, what else? What else? What else? It's hot. <laughs> um, drank a lot of water. Drank a lot of Gatorade. And uh, yeah, so, you know, all in all, it was a good day. Hope everybody, uh, I'm sorry I didn't film very much again, guys. It's real tough when I'm in the truck with a trainer to film because, you know, the way I look at it, when you're in a truck with a trainer, you're pretty much on a job interview, right? I mean, they're wanting to make sure that you uh, are paying attention to what they're saying, not, not filming so much, right? So, yeah, day two in the books. So... Uh, Day three tomorrow. Tomorrow is supposed to be the lightest day. Um, we'll see. There's no predictor there. But we did about 205 packages today with uh, 104 stops. That's what it all ended up being. But there were some issues, like I said, with some customers that didn't have packages ready and we ended up having to wait. And, you know, in the case of this customer, she was quite elderly, just got out of the hospital. She's a business owner, ran like a dry cleaner. So, you know, it's going to take her some time, and that's cool. I mean, it just it just threw us behind. Now, we, of course, we made all of our pickups and everything like that. So, you know, wasn't that big of a deal, really. But it did put us behind a little bit. My trainer was a little bit, uh, well, he wasn't pissed, but he was just a little bit frustrated because we should have been done. Should have been done about 5 o'clock. So it was closer to 6 by the time we get done. But hope I'm not boring you guys too much with this content. I'm just trying to make sure I'm keeping everybody that is interested posted on what's going on with me. Um, more to come soon, guys. Uh, I did film a little bit inside the truck, which I think uh, you might have already seen. I probably already threw that in there. I don't know yet. I haven't edited anything yet. But thanks everybody very much for watching Not Timmy 66 Thanks for coming along for the adventure. I'm about ready to go home, get some dinner, take a shower, and relax. If you have not subscribed to Not Timmy 66 please consider subscribing. If you are subscribed to Not Timmy 66, thank you so very much. That's it for today, guys. Not Timmy 66, signing out. No matter what you do in life, guys, I think you can.